Benalla has an amazing variety of sports for all ages. Sport involves a community, connects a community and encourages a healthy lifestyle. So let's see what our rural city has to offer and what role sport plays in our lives. Right, one through the middle. Right, run. 14. 15. Well, when I first came to Benalla in 1987, I went to St Joseph's Cricket Club. Fantastic club. Run by really good people like Steve Smith, Gary Joyce, um, John Harrison. And Gary Fraser was part of that then. They were fantastic. And, well, the best part of coaching junior crickets, seeing them go on and progress to senior cricket, be good, be good senior cricketers, and then even some have gone on to play great cricket in Melbourne. Oh, I get a real buzz out of that. Whenever, whenever I come home and I, I train around the, the roads around around Benalla, around Lurg and Samaria, it, it brings you know some great memories back of uh, riding as a youngster out here, coming out to the Benalla Cycling Club and racing against a lot of the other the young kids from the, the region and, and then some of the older guys as well. Uh, it, was, it was an exciting time to come out and you know, try myself against the other guys, so um, that was some of my, most, of my fondest memories. Barry Burns was always a, a ma massive influence on me as a youngster. Um, he took me on when I was probably about uh, you know, 15 years of age and, and uh, helped me and coached me through many of my initial years in cycling and uh, to this day I still you know ring him up and get advice off him about certain little things so yeah I think he would I wouldn't have had the right direction right from the beginning without him. Yeah motor racing was always a favourite sport of mine um, obviously massive uh, family background in the sport from my grandfather through my uncles to my father racing so um, I guess I just followed in their footsteps. One of the highlights for me in my motor racing career is uh, getting my grandfather to come across to one of my uh, go-karting events as a young kid. Um, it meant a lot to me. Um, something, somebody that I've always looked up to and tried to aspire to and uh, uh, I guess it probably brought the best out of me in that, in that event to try and, you know, I guess impress him. So um, it was just uh, pretty, uh, meant a lot to me. Horse riding is something I've done since I was three. I've done it ever since then and always loved it. The club um, here at Benalla is the Big Valley Quarter Association and I've been here ever since I was really young. I showed my first pony here and I've grown up here forever. So that's probably the club. And the, there's not really a person that's really inspired, it's inspired me. It's probably my whole family. Um, my nan, my mum, my pop. It's kind of just something I've always done. My event highlight probably would be getting chosen two years ago as the youngest representative of Australia to go to America and I showed in America and just recently I've been chosen to go to Germany to show there next year so that's pretty exciting. Um, some of the great memories I've got are definitely probably this playing down in this, in this stadium, I think. Um, yeah, from age of about 10 or 11, I started playing for the, uh, the Vanilla rep side, and that's certainly had a um, big influence in my basketball career from then. So yeah, definitely um, in this gym, I think. Always had a soft spot for footy as a young kid. I played um, Auskick through to under 14s, and the um, only, only reason I had to give it up was because of basketball. I just had more of a love for it, and then, um, just just recently, last 12 months is when uh, football started to come back to me and really uh, regained a love for it again, I think. It always um, uh, puts a smile on my face to um, come into the town uh, just to catch up with um, mates and yeah, just to be back in a town that you grew up in, I guess it's, um, it's good. Yeah.
Benalla Equestrian Precinct has World Cup class equipment and facilities and the Benalla Race Club has recently upgraded its grass track and it is now one of the state's leading country race tracks. We've had uh, two wonderful success stories uh, going into the thoroughbred racing industry. Uh, Natasha Boucher, she's strapped and was track rider of the Melbourne Cup winner, Shocking. And also uh, Dwayne Reed was a uh, product of the uh, Benalla Pony Club and a uh, lovely young lad. He uh, was travelling foreman track rider for Bart Cummings for a couple of years and is still uh, highly respected and uh, training horses himself now. Probably one of the highlights is actually moving to Benalla and meeting all of these athletic young women that were really keen to be involved. I was involved with bringing a young group of 14, 15, 16 year olds uh, and training them up and we actually won the premiership in the 17 and under in the Golden Valley League for Benalla Saints in uh, 2008. So I think that's probably the biggest highlight. Uh, my husband Mick Roger was probably my biggest inspiration. He was on the board of Benalla Saints at the time and encouraged me to come down here and get involved in netball. So it's been one of the, the best things I've done. I think we've won uh, seven premierships in the last 10 years and uh, it's been very gratifying. The best thing about Benalla is that uh, you're able to do cross training. You're able to train on the football field, which is magnificent. You've got the netball courts adjacent. You've got the lake to run around. Uh, Benalla Netball Association feeds really well the youngsters into our club. Uh, it really has everything you want in, a clo in close proximity. Yeah, growing up in Manila, I played a few few different sports. I played basketball up until I was about 14 or 15. That was always great fun to get down into the stadium there and played uh, just predominantly footy and cricket other than that and sort of uh, played cricket up until I was about 17 or 18 and, and footy the whole way through. So they're probably the three main sports I played growing up here, yeah. I got the opportunity to play AFL through the Murray Bush Rangers 2AC Cup program that they run. I was uh, lucky enough to get picked up by Brisbane and head up there a few years ago in the pre-season draft so they gave me an opportunity and I'll be forever grateful for that opportunity that they gave me. I suppose everyone inspires you along the way growing up playing footy, everyone shows you little different things along the way but I suppose Jeff Henry as an under 18s coach, he was sort of my first serious coach and he taught me a lot about the game and he's got a great, great footy brain and he uh, is quite professional so to have him as a coach when I was 14, 15. Was, uh, was fantastic for me and taught me a lot about the game and, and the way to be professional and prepare yourself for footy.